evening all. It's the night before the big ride. Um, fortunately for us in Melbourne, that's where we are here, um, the weather's held off. You know, it's pretty dark and cloudy, but we haven't had any rain today. Um, and some of the locations we're heading to, I had a bit of a look at those, and they haven't really had much at all, um, less than expected, which is good. So I did an oil change today, um, and I put on the nice C&C &C, um, oil filter. Um, I added a bit of extra oil before, that's where I've dripped that. I'd wiped it, then added a tiny bit more. Um, so oil filler cap and oil filter cover, and it's transparent. So you can actually see the oil in there. Um, I saw a guy took this up the Northern Territory with it on there, and it's well machined, not leaking at all, and had no issues with it. So pretty cool. You can see that the oil's flowing around and being retained up there. Um, I also moved my quad lock to be dead center, so I can actually have my phone horizontal instead of vertical, and fit it around, move the Garmin. So it's actually sitting outbound of the center, but it works really well. And I did a test run with the camera sitting here, facing me and facing the front, and worked really well, like facing me, because the mics are facing me as well. It was usable audio, as far as motorbike sound and all that sort of stuff, which is great. We'll be back in 20 minutes, let's get some petrol. Um, facing the other way, you get a little bit of noise, but I'm happy with that, so that's all good. And we're packed, so like I said, I've already gone through what's up here, just real lightweight stuff, Ooh, gear, gear, apples, muesli bars, um, wet weather gear, that sort of thing. Then the panniers, I'm not, not, not taking a lot because we're not camping. So we've got a little dry pack, which is just extra pair of motorbike, like um, motorbike pants, like your, um, I don't know, some Italian brand, but my brother-in-law didn't fit him, so I got him, but they're your pants, like streetwear pants, but with all your Kevlar and all that protection. A pair of them, a pair of tracky pants, two still t-shirts just for at night time when we're away. A pair of volleys is my shoes. Uh, we've got multiple pairs of socks. Then we've got jocks, and then we've got, um, oh no, socks in one, jocks in one of them, and then the other gear for riding. So uh, two, an extra jersey, extra one or two or three different little compression t-shirts, I think, because I think I'm just going to be wearing my um, Liat Air Fit Light, 3DF Air Fit Light on skin, which I wore in grand because it was fine wearing it on your skin, and then just a t-shirt, like one of those sort of sports tops on top, the real lightweight ones, and then just my jacket. Um, so we'll pack the bike now, all packed, so if it's in there not a problem, that one's a little bit wider, this one here is a bit narrower again, um, it's already offset weight wise because I've got my tools on the side opposite the exhaust, um, mount the cameras how I want them, I did try a mount with a selfie stick here, the mounts I've got currently aren't strong enough with a selfie stick once you add that leverage of weight. They're fine for the actual camera, so I've taken a few notes too. So this one works perfect. I'll try to leave here. And um, the settings on the Osmo Action, like you can set like five different defaults. So just put a few notes of what they are. Like R means rock steady, rock steady, like their stabilizer, rock steady plus, rock steady plus, ultra wide, wide, ultra wide, wide. So a few different settings and what works each. So I know C3 here gives a good shot getting the KLR in. It sort of gets, I guess, that sort of shot for while you're riding down the road, give or take. Um, and then the other one I'm using is here, which is good. I have it facing me and just loosen this, spin it around and face the other way. And it's facing me with the camera being the microphones this side, it gives, gives usable audio. So I'm happy with that. So all good, all ready. Um, ready for tomorrow to take off.